nghĩa vợ chồng Hello, good morning everybody, it's me Kyle and this is the last day of this week-long series traveling central Vietnam. We are going to finish off breakfast right here at arguably the world's best bun mi shop according to Anthony Bourdain and many people here in Hoi An. So let's see what all the hype is all about. Already I can tell this is a special kind of bun mi. It's longer, uh, it is loaded, fully loaded. It's got so many different types of meat, pork, sausage, an egg, beef. Wow, it's got everything. This is incredible, guys. Wow, grilled meat, nam, grilled pork, oh my gosh. All right, you know what, enough talking, let's eat. I can see why this is insanely popular now. Is it the best? Mm, no, it's not. Not in my opinion. I've had better. But this is unique and truly good for Vietnam. In fact, it's probably one of the best for Vietnam that I've had. Yeah, probably one of the best for Vietnam. But the best in the world, no. I think OC has some pretty good ones. This, this thing in the back of my head right here, I don't know if you guys can see. A lot, a lot of people probably wonder. This is actually a scar from when I jumped off of a, a sofa, I was jumping on the sofa, and the cushion came out, and I hit my head on the coffee table. And then from that moment on, my, my, my parents never ever had a coffee table in the house because of that moment. Wow. Wow, that's cheap. It's only 25,000 dong, guys. Like, a little bit more than a dollar for all that meat. That's incredible. Okay, what you guys saw there were three guys who walks around Hoi An. One dude sings and the other guy sells household products like toothbrushes, um, scrubs and knickknacks, all that, Q-tips and all that. And we supported them and in return, they sang us an amazing song. Oh man, I love street performers in Vietnam. Oh. Lòng còn tràn bao nhung nhớ hình bóng của người em thơ trong tôi gối tròn ước mơ. Tôi sẽ về thăm quê hương hồng ngự. Em ăn rồi trước, bà ăn rồi trước ăn đi. You guys want a banana? Come on, you guys want a banana? Yeah. Come on, come on. Have you done a lot? Have you done a lot? Yeah. Oh, hôm hôm qua, what time did you get here? Yeah, the guy who came here yesterday is Linh Phú. Ah, okay. He wants to buy. Trying not to buy stuff, but I always end up buying stuff. You buy bánh quế, hả man? Bánh quế là gì? Bánh đường trang, thơ mười quế đó, man. Nóng mười lòng. Okay, hôm nay cái này được rồi. Yeah. Rồi, cảm ơn nha. I know I always never use the stuff that I buy from these vendors, but I always buy anyway to support them. Which one did you get? How much were they? 80. 80. Ngày nào cũng bắt được. Ừ. 
Ừ. Ừ. Có có bự bán chục cái. Có bự có bự như là bán cái. Có bự cắn bông cái rồi bự bán chục cái. Ừ. Sao bình thường là là chú uh, bán cái này buổi buổi sáng đây. À bữa mít mít chiều thôi. Rồi rồi chiều rồi, chú lên phố. Chú chú lên phố để đi làm uh, rau răm. Không có đi bán tiếp chứ. Bán bán tiếp. Ừ. Ủa gì hôm hôm qua mình thấy là thấy nhau là ở đâu? À, đi hồi rau muống nữa. Hồi rau muống. Chú hôm qua mà cất cái bò bón gì đó mà lòng hai bịch về cái à, hai cái ly nước đúng không ly nước không uống đúng đúng không quay đó đúng rồi nhưng mà cái đó là lúc chú chú đi bán này hả à. đâu đâu thấy đâu thấy này đâu đó chú, chú, chú ngồi chú để ngay chưa ờ để không thấy hả à, ok sau bằng buổi sáng thì dưới đây à, à ok cô à, coi có duyên gặp lại nha à. tự nhiên ở đâu mà không gặp mình gặp lại đi à. Ủa, thế, Ủa? thấy giống giống thấy quen quen không thấy quen qua gặp bên kia rồi ừ. làm phim mà sau nó chuẩn bị à, chắc chuẩn bị nghỉ mất Ừ, không sắp sắp sẽ đi về đây sắp đi về sắp về một tiếng nữa đi một tiếng nữa bay đi rồi bay đi à, cảm ơn chú nhiều nha à, ok xin chào à, chúc cháu thành công ok cảm ơn chú nhiều xin chào ok so not too far from Hoi An is this place Good Eye Beach it's uh, about 7 kilometers away and uh, it's not that great of a beach unless you like big sandbags uh, but a lot of you will visit here when you do stay in Hoi An and I recommend it uh, something else to do, right? And in the afternoons, they have seafood here. Uh, my problem here is I always buy from vendors who come up to me and offer me things that I know that I won't use or need after buying them, such as these sunglasses. Uh, I paid a hundred thousand dong for them. I know I paid too much, but it's okay. I was helping the guy out, and he was a really great guy. Uh, reminds me of my own family members. So, uh, you know. I, I still prefer these because these are actually real and they offer real UVA, UVB protection. But uh, I'll give these to Andrew. There you go. Put them on. Put them on. Yeah, it's all yours, Andrew. Put them on. Put them on. Seem pretty decent. What do you guys think? Do you guys think Andrew looks good uh, there? Yeah. Feel free to leave a long comment below, a long paragraph. Uh huh. Yeah. Wall of text. <laughs> yeah, a wall of text for Andrew. Yeah, please describe uh, his new sunglasses. All right, I'm just gonna give you guys material to write about. See, they all doubted me. They're like, "You can't fly a kite. You don't know how." And look at me now. See? This is, this is what I say to my haters. Go fly a kite. <laughs> I'm really good at it. Hey. I should have drank milk. Anh tặng em cái diều luôn nha. Dạ em cảm ơn anh nha. Dạ em cảm ơn anh. Dạ em cảm ơn anh. Dạ em cảm ơn anh. We just decided to sit down right next to the beach to grab some lunch, some family style gum chua. Of course you have the gan the soup. The Vietnamese love the soup. This is some gan gai with pork. Soup, vegetables and pork some uh, bok choy with some garlic gum ching yung chow or gum ching chung fried rice with eggs and of course the classic simmer tit style pork belly dish protein carbs veggies soup very very iconically vietnamese all right let's dig in okay, so despite being lunchtime right now I'm not feeling too hungry. I think that bun mi is still quite filling. And I drank a bunch of things as well. I'm more thirsty than hungry. But on travel days like today, we don't know when our next meal is gonna be, so I might as well just eat something. Yes! I'm I'm right, chờ ăn cái đây lâu lắm rồi. So cũng hơn gặp cô được. Yeah. Hey, xin chào. Yes. Okay, let's go try it. Tofu, warm, with a hot ginger cream. I'm sure there's a better English interpretation of it, but I'm just gonna eat it anyways. I've been waiting for this for a long time. It's hot. Mm. 
I mean, you can find this in Saigon, but you have to find like a lady who sells it. It's usually early in the morning or late at night. And I just haven't been lucky enough to find a consistent lady. They, they roam around. You have to be really lucky to get it. Mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Okay, so we have landed back in Saigon. Everybody is here uh, after a like one hour delay. <sighs> We've landed and we're gonna head towards the Gulf Up right now and we're gonna see some friends who just came all the way from Manitoba. Yeah, that's Canada to you. <laughs> hello, hello, hello guys. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, wow. Holy crap, holy crap, you're taller than me. He's catching up to you. Oh my gosh, Every everybody is so freaking tall. Oh my gosh. So tall, man. Hey, so is this your brother? Long time. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Hello. landing you know I'm kind of like mesmerized and a little bit like grouchy in the whole situation because Saigon is actually very loud compared to the Lac and uh, the Lac Da Nang and uh, Hoi An so it's just kind of a little bit overwhelming the traffic and just the cars and like that it's a little, it can be quite quite overwhelming for me to be honest Canadians in the house you know represent with the Winnipeg hello hello if you guys remember Alex and Ben be sure to give them a thumbs up from videos long ago I was on a boat with him once, and then we went to uh, a waterfall together, and an amusement park. All right, let's look at what the Canadians bought me from Canada. Real Canadian cherries. Uh, some Nike shoes that I was looking for, but couldn't find in Vietnam. Um, some uh, some new sunglasses. His mother ones were stretched up, and. French hemorrhoid cream. Thank you very much. And many hours later, here I am at home. It is in the middle of the night. I'm exhausted. In fact, leaving Da Nang, going back to Saigon and getting into that traffic, that noise, that just humidity, it really made me feel exhausted. I, I am beat. That trip really took a lot out of me. Um, I'm just exhausted. <laughs> And tomorrow I have work early as well. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'm sorry if the ending seemed kind of rush. Follow me on social media to stay up to date with what I'm doing and all my life and that good stuff as well. This series is over, but I'm going to try to do daily releases. Not just from Saigon, but from Hanoi and Bali. So come back soon. Come back every day. Tell your friends. Okay? It has been grueling doing this for you guys, but... I've enjoyed it, and I know you guys enjoy it, so I want to keep doing it for as long as I possibly can. We'll try to do it daily, maybe miss a day here and there, please forgive me about that. But as long as you guys are still watching, tell your friends, let's make this grow together. We hit 59,000 subscribers recently. Just, ugh, incredible guys. Oh, by the way, look, this shirt is coming your way soon. Kyle Le original shirt, coming your way soon. You can buy it very soon. Good night.